For many of you that may not know, um, this has gone on, when I say too long, 16 years. They met in uh, seventh grade at uh, Bridgewater Middle School. When Brooke came home after those two had met, she had this sparkle in her eye. Seventh grade, this child had seen somebody that meant a lifetime to her. You ready? Always been. I still remember the first moment I saw you. Seeing you for the first time, I didn't know it then, but looking back now, I know the feeling that I felt was love at first sight. Growing up together has been the highlight of my life. From the start, it's felt like our hearts recognized each other. We follow the seasons The pathways that lead us Search for a memory Like heaven is sending us along Brooke Alexandrina Moore, my beautiful and soon-to-be wife and Miss Brown. Where do I even begin? We have known each other longer than we haven't, and I think that speaks volumes to what our story and love truly is. From the very first time I laid my eyes on you in middle school on the soccer field, I could not believe how beautiful you were and that I knew I wanted to make you mine forever. I could stay here forever by your side at the edge of the water under the sky. We have faced a number of challenges throughout our multiple relationships from middle school to high school to moving to a different state and eventually finding ourselves together again at Auburn, where we both knew in middle school that we were going to end up and find each other again without a doubt. Throughout everything that we have been through from the best of times to the most challenging times, we have overcome everything that has been put in front of our faces and we will continue to do that together. We have an unspoken bond and connection when we look into each other's eyes. I've never wished for anything more in my entire life than to spend the rest of my life with you. I can't believe the day it's finally here. I am simply enamored by you. Little do you know how many times a day I look at you and think to myself how much I love you, adore you, and couldn't live without you. You love me so well, so perfectly, so preciously, and so intentionally. God made your love for me and made my love for you. I feel my most true self when I'm with you. You leave me wild and you don't try to tame me. And this is the most certain and sure thing that I've ever done in my life said it will ever be. work as a team and build our empire. Always have fun with you, love you, care for you, the way you so deserve, understand you, and hear you always, and most importantly, put you, my wife, above all else. We are now officially becoming the best team in the world and cannot be more excited for our future and to build the life we have been both dreaming about since middle school. I love you so much and cannot believe you will finally become my wife. I mean the world.
the love story of the century. Watching you two throughout all these years has been such a blessing. You two are very special, and we have all known it since day one. Even when the universe tried to separate you two, you always found a way back to each other. And that's what true love is. You will always be each other's forever, and I will forever root for you guys. I love you, Mom and Dad. <laughs> forever. We go to college, he goes to Auburn, I go to Ole Miss, a little hotty toddy there. We would always go visit each other, and, you know, while we go, you know, he's talking to us about this girl, Brooke. And we're just like, is this that same Brooke that we prank called in high school multiple times because we know she would answer the phone? And he's like, yeah, that one. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. She sounds really great. So then we meet her. The more and more that we got to know Brooke, got to hang out with them, it's just like, wow, these two are just absolutely perfect for each other. There's a saying that when your children find true love, your parents find joy. Here's to Dean and Brooke. May you always have the joy and the love together. Oh,